Hey there, welcome, welcome, welcome. This is statistics class. So um, starting today, Monday and Tuesday and Thursday, we will be asynchronous, which means that you kind of plan out your day and figure out how it is that you will work in everything that is on the syllabus, right? So let me give you some uh, quick reintroductions. This is AP and a dual enrollment course through Community uh, Portland Community College. Um, so there will be a registration window that will open up here shortly uh, at the end of April so that you can get registered for the college credit if you so choose to do that. That costs you nothing to do, just being in the class and doing the work that we're doing. But also we're gonna prepare you for the AP test, which will be coming up really quickly into this semester. So we want to make sure that we're kind of keeping the gears rolling as we do that. Um, there are two sections in here, period three and period four. And yes, they will be in person at Lake Ridge High School, or uh, a few of you are doing this entire class asynchronously, right? So I will try to keep you guys informed as well with what we're doing. So keep following along. Um, so period three and period four. Um, so a couple things that I need you to do today before you get into your coursework is to make sure that you have active accounts on all the things that we're doing. We didn't do the first one um, in, um, in the first half of the course, but we're doing this platform now. It is called My Open Math. So let me put that for you. My Open Math math.com. What you're going to do is go ahead and sign up for at myopenmath.com. And at some point, they're going to ask for a course ID. Now that course ID that we need to put in is 107640. And that'll get you into a class called statistics. Okay, so that's what I need you to do. So go ahead and if you need to pause this video now, go register for that course. We need to get into that course because uh, half of our content will come through here as, as we're um, producing um, this stuff. That is whether you are in period three or period four, we're gonna go in there and then I'm gonna make sure I will subdivide the sections once we get there. So again, go ahead and get that done. All right, so that's one. The second thing I need you to do, we need a second piece is go to Khan Academy. Now, um, if you were um, in this course for quarter two and you didn't change periods, you should be fine. You should be, just be able to log back into your Khan Academy and just make sure it's active again because we will be using it. If you change periods or you're new to this course because you switched over from a different instructor, um, if you're in the third period course, I need you to go to add teacher in Khan Academy and go ahead and put this code in E H G nine J Y nine six. Okay. So that would be Khan Academy, go to add teacher, put in this code and that'll get you into our course here. Um, again, if you are already in third period, second quarter, then all you need to do is re-log in and, and you're gonna, you're, you're already there. You don't have to, that, that should already still be active for us. If you're in fourth period, and again, same thing, if you are already currently in the fourth period last semester, then when you come into here, just need to re-log in and you're fine. But if you happen to be new or you switch classes, you're gonna go B, G, seven, U, six, J, P, V. Okay, so that's the one that you're gonna be doing on that one. That will get you into that. So that's gonna be your, your biggest goal right now is to literally get into this here and make sure that you can re-log into that there. All right. So 
That's the deal. So again, the next three days are asynchronous, which means working on your own. And all the next three days are all about reviewing first semester ideas. So I need you to stay on top of that. So as you go to look at your syllabus, you're going to start looking at different pieces, right? So the one, it says video introduction. That's the one you're watching right now. Watch it through. Second thing you're going to do is start to work on some free response questions. Actually, I'm going to have a video in between there. Sorry. So the second thing you're going to do is video, and I'll just kind of give you big, big, broad overview recap of what we've done in the first semester. That way you kind of get the gears turning again, maybe flip through the old notes, pull them out and be like, okay, I got my notes, chapters one through seven, okay? So if you pull out those old notes, hopefully you still got them because I asked you to submit them every single time. So if you still got them, I'm gonna pull those out. And as you're doing review stuff, you're like, oh, I remember how to do this, I remember how to do this, right? It's gonna give us time to do that. Um, so, and then, and then what you'll do, you'll go through and do some free response questions. There's four of them to do on Monday today, right? Four of them to do, and then go check the video link as I wa walk through them all. So you can kind of check, you can modify, and then you'll take a picture of that, upload it to Google Classroom, and then you'll open up your My Open Math, right? That's the one that you just created here. Open up the My Open Math, you're going to see quarter two review assignment. And let's go ahead and start working on that. And then as you come back to class on Tuesday, you're going to have three more free response questions. Go ahead and do those. Check the work, upload that, and start keep working on this My Open Math review assignment. And then on Wednesday, work on the My Open Math review assignment. Right? And um, take time, if you haven't finished those free response questions, finish them, upload them. And then you do have homework, though, on Wednesday night. It is to watch a video. It's 8.1. It's the first new content that we're getting into here. So we run a flipped classroom. What a flipped classroom means is that you will watch the video and go through the guided notes for homework. And then when you come to class physically in the building, we will recap it, go through some examples, answer some questions, and then send you on your way to start doing the next thing right? That's our routine. So we call this a flipped classroom, right? For those of you who are staying asynchronous all year long, it's, you, it, it's going to be natural for you because you watch the flipped classroom, you do the assignments and you move on, okay? So just know that that is how we are doing this. So um, just make sure you map out your next three days. Today, asynchronous, go through, make it like a checklist as you go through it. Tuesday is asynchronous, going through the free response, going to my open math, Wednesday, it's kind of a cleanup day, right? Clean up anything. So finish out the free response questions, finish off the My Open Math review and, um, and then watch your homework and take some guided notes. And then when we get together on Thursday, we'll recap and do problems, all right? I'm excited to see you guys in class and work with you guys some more. And those who are staying asynchronous, um, I'm excited to kind of work with you guys as well, and just make sure that I, I'm keeping in constant uh, communication with you guys. Um, remember that we still have all Wednesdays, except for this first one, all Wednesdays we'll have a mini, mini virtual meeting so that you can ask questions and do all you need to. So especially those um, online, I'm gonna need you to take advantage of that time, okay? All right, you know, guys, enjoy the day, get the work done today, and then show up again for the next few days. Remember, map out your next few days. And then we will see you on Thursday.